I had a 70 Charger and I parked it next to my 70 Cornette. I have a picture of both of them together. And when I looked at the picture, I thought, oh, it would be neat to make a Charger convertible. Back then, it was a 70 Cornette convertible that I, that I had. And I realized how similar they were and that they would both be, it'd be able to make it. And I just kept putting it off, but I finally did it. And I'm enjoying driving it. Hi, I'm Ron Ridgway. Drove my one of none. 1970 charge convertible from Virginia, a little over 600 miles. Here enjoying a nice weekend here at uh, Mopar Party. Started out as a 1968 Cornet convertible, uh, just collecting parts and basically transferring it to a convertible, you know, making it look like a stock 1970 uh, Charger, which they never made, and it would have been nice if they did. I actually, this is a copy of my high school car that was I drove but only a hard top back then. I love convertibles, so I made this one to uh, drive and enjoy, and we've been enjoying driving it. We uh, did this all at home in the garage, most of everything except for the paint at the, my work. Uh, my boys came with me, and they have helped me do the car throughout the job. We basically bolted everything in the front on, and then the back end was fabricated to make it look like stock and everything. So the car is pretty much stock as much as possible as I can make it to look like something they made. The doors have to be changed, the glass doors are different. Otherwise, everything else bolts on and welds on. I came up with this a long time ago. I have another surprise if I ever finish it that it will be a sensation if I can finish it. Uh, it has a 440 automatic, 323 rear, the power windows, the option up chrome, the packages, just AC, extras, of, to make it, you know, the luxury car that it was supposed to be. Took the car to Carlisle, Mopar Carlisle, and then we've taken it to Mopar Nationals, and I just said, man, I gotta come down here for this show, and um, we just said, man, we gotta make a road trip out of it and drive it and be a road trip to remember. So it has been.